Two minutes on the path of grace. Keep in mind that the context of a word or a verse actually spans the entire Bible. The immediate context is what comes just before a verse and what comes just after it. The remote context ranges from the remainder of the chapter to the book and then to the whole Bible from Genesis to Revelation. And you've got to keep in mind that there are portions of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation which are specifically addressed to particular people. The law of Moses was given to Moses to give to who? Israel. To give to the Jews for a certain time. I can't think of too many people today who want to go back and place themselves under the law and start sacrificing animals, right? And even in the New Testament, portions of the New Testament are still part of what was happening under the law of Moses for Israel. For instance, what people refer to as the gospel accounts, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Jesus was a Jew speaking to the Jews. He said, I have not come except for the lost sheep of the house of Israel. He was a Jew addressing Jews who were living under the law of Moses. He was speaking to them before his death and before his resurrection. After his death and resurrection, some things changed. However, even when you look at the New Testament, or what we call the New Testament today, there are also portions of that where it is specifically addressed to the 12 tribes of Israel, and then other portions, like the writings of Paul, that are specifically addressed to the nations or to the Gentiles. And so there are things that apply specifically to you and me today, and some things that don't. To hear more, visit jamesflanders.com.